The Wedding Haunted by Jinns. This story is real it was covered by the newspaper everyone was talking about it. They even did an episode in a TV show about it and it took place in Kuwait in 1997. Back in the days people used to have weddings in their homes and it was a tradition to bring a wedding singer. There was a very famous wedding singer called Nora she used to perform in Kuwait and also in other countries. One day a woman called her to sing at her daughter's wedding on Thursday at 10 p.m. in an area for 500 KD which was a lot of money to be paid for a wedding singer at that time. So Nora was very excited and went with the rest of the band that was around six to seven women to that house on Thursday night. First when they arrived the house was very bright lights everywhere it was very beautiful people were dancing enjoying their time so the band went straight to a room that was prepared for them where they can set their instruments, rehears and get themselves comfortable and wait till the rest of the guests arrive. Once it's 10.30 p.m. they started performing at first everything was fine but the house was getting crowded with people that it looked like it was impossible for a small house to have so many people in it and it was really hard to walk or even move the band was singing till it reached midnight around 12 a.m. between each song the brides and grooms parents would greet them and thank them for their work also some guests would come up to them and request certain songs. During their break one of the band member asked the lead singer Nora haven't you noticed something strange about the guests? Nora was confused and said what do you mean? She then replied their skin it was really rough and we all felt weird heat coming from them. Nora then laughed it off saying you must be imagining. Then she replied it's like they have spikes on their faces how could you have not noticed? Nora was already nervous and bit scared but she tried not to show it she told a few jokes to try laugh it off so the rest of the band wouldn't be nervous and ruin their performance they kept on singing. Now it's after midnight and people were getting very excited it was not normal they didn't get tired and they kept demanding more. While they were singing the band noticed something that sent chills down their spine when they saw the people that were dancing did not have human legs they had animal legs like hooves. They were all terrified it even showed in their voices while singing. At that moment, Nora looked at the band and winked at them to let them know we need to sing louder and act like everything was fine so they kept on going but one of them was too scared so she fainted so some of the guests came up to them and asked is she okay? Nora said she's fine she's just a little tired so they went to that room when they first arrived and they were all scared Nora said you all know that these people are not human we know they are jinns. Now we need to act like we don't know and that everything is fine so they don't harm us and we can leave so they came back and starting singing again till the dawn prayer started and suddenly it became so cold and all the electricity and power suddenly went off and it was dead silence at that point. The band just lost it they started screaming in terror but Nora was telling them to stop screaming she was praying and reading Quran and said now it's time to run for the exit. When they managed to run away from the house they saw an old man near the house when he saw them he was so scared he said how the hell did you come here? They didn't know if he was even human but he was just a normal man they told him they were at a wedding in that house I'm the lead singer and this is my band. The man looked at them so confused and asked what house? She pointed at it and she was so shocked so was everyone in the band the house was completely empty and dark no sign of a wedding or anyone that was even in it so they started asking each other where were the people? The cars the lights? The ground was sand and there was no sign of anything not footsteps nothing. The man said no one is living here the owners left 10 years ago and this house is haunted we all know its story you shouldn't go in it. After this incident the singer Nora never sang or attended a wedding again in her life.